Instagram every year, the challenges celebrities and normal humans alike undertake to raise money for comic relief get wackier and wackier. This year, Strictly Come Dancing presenters Claudia Winkleman and Tess Daly are undertaking a 24 hours of dancing, all in the name of the charity. Claudia and Tess dance for 24 hours for comic relief sounds exhausting, right? According to Live Reports, the pair who kicked off their stint on Monday at 7.15 p.m., have been bandaged up and are in agony as they pass the halfway mark. As shared on Daly's Instagram page, the pair strength trained for months to prepare their bodies for the challenge, think planks, kettlebell swings and medicine ball slams. When it comes to eating to fuel their bodies for the challenge, it's an intense situation. Chatting on the one show last night, the pair shared that they'll get through 10k calories to keep up their strength up. We eat while we dance, Winkleman joked. We'll be eating, 10k calories. Winkleman replied, pizza, sweets, bowls of pasta, chocolate. Claudia listed off before adding that she'll also be consuming extra caffeine in attempt to help her stay awake. But what does an expert have to say on the dance-a-thon, and subsequent eat-a-thon? When exercising for long periods of time at a high to moderate intensity, the body will burn energy at a faster rate than when sedentary, says registered nutritionist Rhiannon Reese. Effectively, if Tess and Claudia fuel themselves adequately, they'll be able to use the extra glucose to work out harder and stronger for the period. Hence the need for pasta, sweets and chocolate, which will provide extra glucose supplies when their bodies are running out. If they don't eat enough and let their glucose reserves get to low or empty, their bodies will start burning through stored glucose, glycogen, and eventually start using stored fat cells as a source of energy, leading to fat loss. So Reese confirms that, as high as the calorie count may sound, the women snacking their way through the challenge is smart, eating more when undertaking an intense exercise regime is vital for avoiding unnecessary stress on the body. For normal workouts, make sure to include good sources of carbohydrates prior to a workout and including good quality protein post-workout to help repair and strengthen the body's cells and muscles. Simple. See you on the 24-hour dance floor.